Welcome to today's game. I'm Bob Costas along with Harold Reynolds and it's EA Sports Triple Play Baseball. Welcome to this regular season matchup featuring the Florida Marlins and the Montreal Expos. Should be some ball game. Here's the starter, Matt Clement. Bob, this right hander throws a nasty assortment of breaking pitch. All right, Harold, this should be an interesting one. It's hit out to short. Got him for the out. Swinging strike. Sinker missed inside. The delivery. Pitch is hit to right. And an out on the play. Hits it hard and through the middle. It's a 1-2-3 in. Castillo steps into the box. And he delivers. Spanks that one right up the middle. He reaches with a leadoff single. That's the first hit of the game for Florida. Here's the pitch. Way late on that one. Hits it hard down the right side. And he's out on the play. They got him double play. Bob, that was perfect. Defense came up big and turned that double play. Hit hard up the middle. Dives, and he's got it. Did you see how he got his body over there and in position? That's why he was able to make that play. At the plate to lead it off, Vladimir Guerrero. This one is scoreless. I think he just threw a bad pitch right there. Here's the pitch. Guerrero bounces one to short. There's an out. He sends that pitch up the middle. Stevens reaches first with a single. That's the first hit of the game for Montreal. And it's grounded up the middle. Double play. The side is retired. Home team coming up. The game is scoreless. Next to the plate, Preston Wilson. The pitch is lashed to the right side. And they got him for the out. He hits it up the middle. That's a stand-up double. He had to be thinking about two from the moment he hit that ball. He whistles one up the middle. A run crosses the play. Run scoring single by Johnson.
Lee over to shortstop. And that's a double play. That ends the inning. They got a couple of base hits and managed to scrape together a run. Leading off the inning, Michael Barrett. In the top of the inning, the Florida Marlins lead by one. Liner hit up the middle. That should be two. Well, they have to take advantage of the runner at second now. The pitch is hit to left. And he's out. The key to scoring runs is cashing in in these situations. It's hit up the right side. They make the play. Up next, Peter Bergeron. A bullet right up the middle. And a run comes home. That single knocks home a run. 0 for 1 today, Orlando Cabrera. It's a 1-1 tie. There goes the runner. The base is stolen by Bergeron. The pitcher never stopped him at all. And he fouls it off right side. Hits it hard and through the middle. Another run crosses the plate. Run scoring single. The score is 2-1. 0 for 1 today. Jose Vidro. You got nothing but air on that swing. He delivers. The pitch is hit up the middle. Single by Vidro. Okay, there you go. That moves him into scoring position. That's five hits in the game for Montreal. Hit hard to the right side. That's the third out. Gonzalez up next. Slider breaks in there for a strike. His breaking ball is really the key to his success. And here's the delivery. Ground ball right side. They put him away for the out. Fastball right down the pipe. He brings it home. Clement with a comebacker. They make the play for the out. With a single earlier, Luis Castillo. Ground ball hit to the right side. The side retired in order. At the end of three, the Florida Marlins trail by one. Leading off, Lee Stevens. Spanks that one right up the middle. Stevens is on with a single. Six hits in the game for Montreal. Blum lines it to short. Stand up double. He was thinking about that double all the way. They didn't even have a chance to make a play on it. I think he knew he went with the wrong pitch at the wrong time. 
He hits it up the middle. A run crosses the plate. A run scores. Two ribbies on the base hit. The score is 4-1. up for a strike. Slider strike. Ducey sends that one out to shallow left. He reaches with a single. 0 for 1 today. Carl Pavano. That's nine hits in this game for Montreal. The runners all take their leads. Change up on the inside edge. Bob, he had to be looking for another pitch. That was right there. Missing outside with the fastball. Lays down the bunt. They complete the play for the out. Playing small ball with the sack bunt. One for two, Peter Bergeron. It's hit back up the middle. A run scores. Base hit, and it scores a run. The score is 5-1. to one. To the plate with a single earlier, Orlando Cabrera. That one's hammered way back and out of here. As soon as he hit that ball, he had his arms raised. Boy, what a smash that was. A three-run blast. They really needed him to come through at the plate right there, and he did. What a good piece of hitting. Here's the pitch. And the pitch. That ball's hit up the middle. That's a single by Vidro. 0 for 2 today, Vladimir Guerrero. 12 hits now in the game for Montreal. The delivery. Hard hit ball over to short. Double play. Out number three as we head to the home half of the inning. 0 for 1 today, Eric Owens. Look out, liner right back to the pitcher. Base hit. Another hit given up by Povano. That's four hits now in this game for Florida. That one was almost in the catcher's mitt before he swung. And here's the pitch. Floyd hits the ball to the mound. He reaches with the base hit. How do you like that, Bob? They moved him along. He's in scoring position now. And he delivers. That one's high and deep and gone home run. Woo! Did he put a swing on that ball? He hit that some 425 feet. That's why this guy's got a spot on this team. He's a good executor. He can make things happen. With that home run, the score is 8-4. Hard hit ball down the right side. Catch is made. I knew he'd make that play. One for one, Charles Johnson. There's a liner back through the middle. Nice catch by Bergeron. He got a good jump right there. Good speed helped him out. 0 for 1 today, Derek Lee. The 
pitch is sprayed down the right side. Base hit. Here's the pitch. Cut on and missed. And there's a grounder to the right side. Out number three, leaving a man on base. After four, the Florida Marlins trail by four. Stepping into the box to lead off the inning, Lee Stevens. And that's a strike swinging. Miss for a ball. And he hits it hard down the left side. Stevens hits a single. 13 hits in this game for Montreal. Change and it looked like it was right down the middle. Hey Bob, that's a pretty good change. Did you see how the batter was full? And here's the delivery. He creams that one down the left side. And he's out of there. They turn the double play. That's just great defense. Nicely turned double play. Barrett hits it on the ground to short. It's a base hit. With a single earlier, Rob Ducey. 14 hits in the game for Montreal. Here's the pitch. Here's a long drive, and that ball is out of here. What a finish. What a job. Damn, he's styling, isn't he? A two-run homer. Well, Bob, that guy can play for me anytime. What a good job right there. He executed. He did his job at the plate. With that home run, the score is 10-4. Pavano hits it out towards shallow center field. There's a base hit. That's 16 hits this game for Montreal. The ball is hit up the left side. That'll do it as we go to the bottom of the inning. Back up the middle, and he's there for the catch in the out. Man, they should call this guy human vacuum. That was a pretty nice running catch. Stepping to the plate with a single already today, Luis Castillo. And that one misses. Good eye. And there's a strike. And here's the delivery. There's a strike with the slider. It's softly out toward right. Good play by Vidra. Bob, he got a great jump on that ball and make a good running catch on that sinking line. Ground ball up the middle. He's on with a base hit. One for two, Cliff Floyd. That's eight hits this game for Florida. And the pitch. Fastball strike. He hits it to the left side. That'll do it. So they got one base hit and they couldn't do anything with it. In the top of the inning, the Florida Marlins trail by six runs. At the plate to lead it off, Orlando Cabrera. It's a 
piece of it, fouls it off. The delivery. Hit hard to short. Out on the play. Coming to the plate, Jose Vidro. The pitch. Grounder hit off the middle. That's another hit for Montreal. Guerrero next to the play. That's 17 hits this game for Montreal. Here's the delivery. Home run, Expos. That's two home runs in this game for Montreal. What a great hit. He had a good approach and had a good at bat. Fastball misses inside. He delivers. Line drive hit right back up the middle. Now that's a good piece of hitting. He waited, got his pitch, hit it hard, and ended up on third base. That's a triple. Runner on third base, less than two outs. All you got to do is make sure you get the ball to the outfield. And here's the delivery. Grounded to the right side. Got him. Three for three, Michael Barrett. Let's see if he can take advantage of the situation right here and help out his team. And here's the pitch. Grounded to the right side. That's the third out. They stranded a runner in scoring position. Stepping in with a run scored in the game, Preston Wilson. Goes with the pitch and sends a liner down the right side. He's on with a leadoff double. Bob, not too many guys can turn that into a double. Good piece of hitting and some extra hustle leads to two. Sent that pitch towards short. And they got him. Close play and he's out. Dare I say, a pitcher's best friend. The double play. One for two, Charles Johnson. Outside with the slider. fouled away misses outside back up the middle the third out and it ends the inning well they got that one base hit but they couldn't turn it into a run here's the first batter of the inning Rob Ducey in the top of the seventh. The Florida Marlins trail by eight. Change in there for a strike. Ducey takes the pitch to left. He's there and makes the catch. Ah, uh, that ball's not much of a challenge, but I don't think the fielder really minded that much. He sends that pitch out to left. Caught for the out by Lowell. Not many fielders in the league could make a running catch like that. At the plate with a couple of singles already, Peter Bergeron. Now batting for the Expos, Peter Bergeron. And he delivers. Now pitching. Hit hard up the middle. And he's at first with a single. 
Next up with a round tripper already, Orlando Cabrera. Curve missing inside. There's a strike swinging. Goes the opposite way with that ground ball. The side is retired with one man left on base. Harold. Oh, uh, yeah, Bob. We are heading for the bottom half of the seventh. You know what that means? I guess I do. It's time to sing. Go ahead, my man. Take me out to the ball game. Come on, go ahead. <laughs> me up to the crowd. No, keep I'm going. I'm sounding good. Too. Keep Find going. Find the up and We love it. It's good. I don't care if I ever get that. Testify. Good food for the home team. If they don't, it's a shame. Belt it out. Oh, it's one, two, three strikes. You're out at the old ball game. Soulful, my man. That Soulful. Woo. I'm just being wonderful. He brings it home. And that ball's grounded down the right side. Redmond fouls that pitch away. Here's a ground ball up the middle. One swing, two outs. Three outs as the inning comes to an end. So they got one base hit and they couldn't do anything with it. Leading off, Jose Vidro. In the top of the inning, the Marlins trail by eight. Outside as he tried the sinker. Slider inside. Hit hard to the left side. He's out of there. One for four, Vladimir Guerrero. That one's fouled away. Misses for a ball. Well hit ball, going deep. Diving catch, what a play. Oh man, Bob, you can better see that play again. That'll be on a lot of highlight reels. Stevens grounds it to the shortstop. Three up and three down. One for three, Luis Castillo. Sends a grounder the other way down the right side. They get the out. Two for three, Eric Owens. And it's grounded up the middle. They got him. Up next, he scored a run earlier, Cliff Floyd. Strike, that was the slider. He sends that pitch up the middle. He's at first with a hit. Two for three, Preston Wilson. That's 11 hits in the game for Florida. The ball is hit up the right side. 
inning is over with one runner left on board. Well, they got that one base hit, but they couldn't turn it into a run. Leading off the inning, Jeff Blum. The Marlins trail by eight. Painted the inside corner. Hit off the left side. He's there and makes the play. Great effort on that kick. Three for four, Michael Barron. Hits it hard down the right side. Got him for the out. Two for four, Rob Ducey. He goes with the pitch and takes it down the left side. It's a 1-2-3 in. What a good play. One for three, Mike Lowell. Brown ball right side. He's out. To the plate with a single earlier, Charles Johnson. Looked like he had no chance on that one. There's a ground ball hit to the right side. And they get the out on the play. That'll bring up Derek Lee. Slider slips outside for a ball. Ground ball up the middle. And that'll do it. The final score, the Montreal Expos 12, the Florida Marlins 4. For all of us at EA Sports Triple Play Baseball, I'm Bob Costas with Harold Reynolds. See ya.